Love our furry friends and this morning I'm here with Alex Catalan from Save the Animals Foundation and you bring us a little furry friend. Who is this? I have this amazing kitten who is full of energy this morning. This is Zorro. Zorro is four months old and um, in his short life he has lived um, quite, the, quite the life already. He um, was born into a, a hoarding situation. And we rescued him at about um, 10 weeks old. Um, and when we rescued him, we found that he had an enlarged heart. Um, and he had a condition called PDA, which um, means that there was basically an opening uh, between two of his major um, heart valves. Um, and so he needed to have s heart surgery at 10 weeks old. Um, and he was amazing. And he just got his completely clean bill of health. He is in great shape to be adopted and he is going to be up for adoption very soon um, and he is just an amazing cat again he has lots of energy he's ridiculously cute um, he loves belly rubs um, he loves to play um, he's just been having a great time here at the studio today i can tell you i fall in love with his little ears he has a little bit of fur sticking out of his ears it's adorable yeah i love i love these little <laughs> his little curls that he has here and his and his whiskers and um, and he loves to just roll over and he loves to play and um, he really enjoys chasing toys, and he's got all that energy that, that you'd expect from a kitten. But, um, but I think he really represents the type of work that we do at Save the Animals F Foundation, where we were able to take in cats who might not make it at other shelters and might not make it in, you know, living um, out in the streets um, and, and get them in great health to be adopted. Um, and, and he is one of those um, you know, shining star examples. He seems to have a great personality, though. He's young, he's curious, which is what you want to see, but he seems pretty calm. I mean, there's a lot going on in here, and he's pretty calm with all of it. He's done really well with the with the trip over here, and I think part of it's that he's he's been through so much. So he's been exposed to lots of different types of people. He you know he grew up with a really large population of cats, unfortunately. So um, he's just been through a lot, and he's he's just quite the uh, quite the brave guy. Um, and and he is just going to be an amazing cat for someone to adopt. And he's he's asking for those belly rubs that I mentioned um, before. He he this cat loves attention. <laughs> so is he a cat? You know, some cats maybe they like like my cat kind of show hide away from people. He wants to be around his person. Yeah. Yes, when I went to go get him this morning, he came right up to the front um, uh, of his of his carrier that he's in, and um, and he was you know full of energy. Um, he's going to be moving into. He's been in isolation for a while as he recovers from surgery, but now that he's got the clean bill of health, he's going to be moving into a room with other cats. Um, all of our cats stay in an, in an isolation period when they when they first come to the shelter, but then they live in these communities. So um, you know, if Zorro is not available for adoption, we have literally dozens and dozens of kittens available for adoption right now, and you can go into a room and sit down and let one pick you. <laughs> and one thing I love to see as a cat owner, lastly, is that, you know, he has the harness, he has the leash, he seems accustomed to that. It makes things like going to the vet a lot easier. Yeah, he, he's very well crate trained. He's very well behaved. Again, he's made lots of trips to the vet already, but but I can't say enough that he got the clean bill of health from the from the cardiologists and, um, and we're just so excited for him to find that forever home. So if people are looking to adopt him, how can they go about doing that? We do adoptions by appointment only. Um, we, we have about 50 cats or 50 dogs anytime and about 250 cats available for adoption. So STAF for Save the Animals Foundation.org is our website. You can apply on there and set up an appointment and then someone will guide you through the shelter to help you find the best match for, the, for you. Well, if you want to learn more, check out our website at fox19.com. Thank you so much for joining us, Thanks Alex. Thanks for having us. And we'll be right back.